I gotta get the bloody hell out of here! Come on, Launch, you damn thing! Ugh, well that settles it. This isn't gonna be a proper landing. Oh, this is not good. Ah! Hold on, get me the fuck off this thing! Work, you piece of crap! Fire! 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 What the fuck? What the fuck? Where's the bloody fire extinguisher? There it is! I'm burning! Ugh. Bloody hell, I didn't want things to go this way. Is my iPad still working? Alright, iPad, what's new? Hurry this up to I want to see if I can contact engineer. Have suffered minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. I say I'm on an alien planet. Well, I hope this planet is a nice one and not a desert like Mars. I mean, seriously, I don't want to end up like that guy from that movie called The Martian. I would hate being stuck in a desert with barely any water, food, or any scrumpy. Well, only one way to find out. Remember I said desert with barely any water? I didn't fucking mean a bloody fucking ocean! God fucking damn! Ah! Alright, let's dive in! Oh, uh, it's been a very long while since I've taken a swim in the ocean. What kind of fish is this? New creature discovered. Can I eat it raw? Do I have to cook it? Well, we'll see if I can cook it. I don't want to get tape worms. First, I gotta repair the pod. Maybe I can fix the radio and contact the mercs for help. First, I have to collect some materials so I can build some repair device. I don't know engineer would know this stuff. The reef looks clear and beautiful. If only the oceans back at Earth were like this too. Not just in islands, but mainlands as well. Later. Finally, after everything, let me see if I can call the mercs. Just repair the pod and the radio. Pod's done! Okay, now the radio. Contact with you, this is Engineer from the Red Team. Can anyone hear me? Engineer, is that you? Am I? Oh, thank goodness you're okay. Good to hear your voice, Engie. The fucking Aurora crash landed on this planet full of nothing but water like Earth, only it looks like ninety percent of the planet is covered in it. Wow, well, looks like it'll take nine, 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 a dozen of mines to come to rescue. Are you fucking kidding me? I can't fucking wait that long, and without Scrumpy, are you kidding me? Hey, don't blame me for this. Blame the people we're associated with. The administrator thought it'd be a good idea to work with them at least. Though their engineering is dialed right awful. You could say that again, though I'm thinking of scavenging of what's left of the Aurora though. Maybe I can find something useful at least. Well, if you're gonna do that, you should be careful. I've read its blueprints, and it's possibly leaking radiation into the ocean waters. They'll send blueprints of the suit when you need it. Okay, thanks, Engie. How are High Gamer and the others? The others are fine, though, no, while well, you weren't looking, High Gamer, quite the POV cam in your other eye. So we can wreck your vitals and how it looks there. Well, why the hell did I not remember it? Because medic mess with your brain cells, so you won't remember it. Oh, bloody hell, whatever you go and scavenge. A 
engineer, I've been finding parts, and if I scan them, they'll make a blueprint. That's good, Demo C. Maybe if you scan some stuff, I can give you info on it, and when it's complete, I'll transfer the blueprint to you. Thanks, lad. Though right now, I'm in a kelp forest from what it looks like. Oh, I see it now. Kelp forests are a bit scary, because what if you get caught and stuck on the kelp? I won't get stuck. Though I see this crocodile-like creature, it'll scan and show it to you. A stalker is what it's called. According to the data, a stalker streamlined predator encountered in the kelp forest in way to prey leaving the safety of the shallows to feed. Uh, the stalker likely car got its evolutionary niche at the sweet spot between speed and size millions of years ago, and maybe one of the oldest species on the planet. NG, I found Pog Free that there's a hole on it and there's no survivors. No survivors? I thought I found a few things, just a pad and the data chip. Well, that's great, Dill. You found any parts for a sea glide? No, that's what I'm looking for. If you're gonna travel long distance, you're gonna need a sea glide, Demo. You're also are gonna need a compass so you won't get lost. That's what I have, Rod. I'll be on my way to find more parts to scan. Well, good luck then. I'll be offline for a while just to see if I can contact anyone else. Just stay safe. Wait, lad! You got a part! I've unlocked the sea glide, lad! Great work, Demo. Just head to your pod and you'll see if I can get you new information. Roger that! Engineer will be heading back!